This is Creativity Unleashed. For all the cutting of the plate steel, I'm using the Hypertherm Power Max 30, which has been an excellent um, plasma cutter. Had really no issues whatsoever with it. Works great. And all the welding here I'm doing with the Tweco Fabricator 252i which is now switched to ESOB. It's an excellent unit, um, excellent multi-process. It does exceptionally well at MIG welding. I'm using straight CO2 with O35 wire. Um, yeah, I would definitely recommend this machine if you're looking for a multi-process amazing stick welding. Um, it does a very good job at it, the TIG that it does, but it's still lift TIG, doesn't have high frequency and whatnot, which can be really nice to have. So. Most all the cutting has been done with the Jet Horizontal Vertical Bandsaw. It's one of Jet's smallest models, but I've had nothing but trouble with it. I would recommend if you're getting, looking for a bandsaw to get a much bigger unit. It should do a lot better. Hello, boys. Right now I'm going to talk about the bottom-up levelers. One of my very nice additions to my masterpiece. So you need yourself a heavy 2-inch washer and your nuts. We weld the nut centered on the bottom of the washer and then you weld that into the bottom of the pipe with the nut on the inside. And with that done so, you can use a bolt that has threads on all of it and you can screw it into the bottom of your pipe. And with that you can change the heights of your table which is very nice for if you have the addition of a chop saw or if you are using the table as an in or an out feed table or just need to match another table in your shop or just for all kinds of amazing <laughs>
And remember when you are um, putting things like legs on a table, um, it's very helpful if you're working on a surface that's already pre-leveled like this. So you can use a level to check your table legs. And um, remember the weld pulls in the direction where you weld it at. So um, you can look for the side that's out a little bit and um, you can weld it in a manner that you can um, remember that you can only pull welds a certain way depending how the metal is. So. Once you get used to it, you can really straighten anything out in like, like two weld tacks or so and you'll have it perfect. So. I hope this was useful for you guys. Um, I'll be planning to do some more additions to the table like some either shelves or some places to hang your grinders and maybe cables or whatnot. But yeah, it's a really great table. and. Remember with the bottom up leveler, it doesn't matter if your floor is on level, you can level it and make the work so much easier when you have a good level flat surface. So I hope you enjoyed and liked this video. Um, check out some of the other stuff and I hope to be uploading some new things soon. Thanks guys so much.